someone riding in my front yard. Uh, yeah, just give me a call tomorrow morning, night. Hello, and welcome to A Day in the Life Of. I'm Trevor Sigmund, and today we have Blake Lamb, a snowboarder with unbelievable talent. I'm so glad you can come here today, Blake. Thank you for having me. Hey, no problem. So, how did you kind of, let's start this off, how did you get started with snowboarding? Well, I, I really don't even like remember how I got started. I probably saw it on the TV one day, and I was like amazed by it, like, wow, like that's what I want to do. And shortly after that, my mom got me and my brother a board. My first snowboard was a Lamar. Okay. And we got a lesson at Alpine. And by the end of that lesson, I could ride down the hill without falling. And then that's where it got started. Man, oh. well, that's awesome. So how, how old are you? I'm 16. And, and you started, when, when did you start? I don't know. I've been riding for like six years now. Okay, okay. And you're... That's awesome. And so, is there was there anyone that you kind of looked up to or that you kind of wanted to be when you first started? Um, I didn't, no, I didn't really look up to anyone. I just watched a lot of pros on YouTube, just like watched their videos and like studied the tricks and that's where I get a lot of my ideas from now. Okay, cool. Um, and so, with, with your name kind of being out there, um, who, who are your sponsors? Like who? Uh, currently, my sponsors are Les Muis, Burton Snowboards, and Smith Optics. Okay. And so I hear a, a kind of a cool story about this. Um, how, how did you get sponsored? Well, I was at Alpine, and I met this kid. And like later that night on Facebook, I got a message, and he said, hey, do you want to film a sponsor video? And I was like, well, yeah, that'd be awesome. And I've watched his videos before and he had tons of views on his videos already. So it took us about like two weekends to film this. And then, so like the first week it came out it had 45,000 views. So yeah, it just quickly got out there. And then I uh, went to the store and like asked them if they'd sponsor me and then So said, you, yeah. went, you went to the store <laughs> and you were like, how do I get sponsored? Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome, man. That's, um, and so, with that, um, what what could you? Any advice for people that kind of kind of where you were? Kind of any advice f to help people? Well, I mean, the main thing is just don't worry about sponsors. Just have fun. That's like the number one main thing you should worry about. Is just have fun with your friends. But for me, I got kind of lucky with him being already like so famous on YouTube because he had a lot of views so it helped me out too but if you want to like get sponsored you just gotta make a video and send it into a lot of places and just hopefully get lucky cool man cool and so with with snowboarding um, you, you gotta have that technique you gotta have that skill some people are born with it uh, but do you do you train where do you train yeah I snowboard like probably like five days out of the week and I I live like seven minutes away from Alpine Valley so okay. that's my main hill that I go to and otherwise I travel around a lot for competitions go to Sunburst, um, Little Switz, uh, Tyrol Basin. Do you go out of state as well? Um, for nationals yes nationals is in Colorado. Okay nice man nice. Um, a little different, Colorado, Wisconsin. A little yeah, different. A little. Um, what's what's your biggest trick on those two two slopes? Because I bet you you can get bigger air. Yeah, they got bigger jumps, in Colorado. So, um, so my best trick is either a 1080 or a double backflip. Dude, you're blowing my mind right now. <laughs> a double backflip. Yep. I'm dizzy already. I, this is ridiculous. <laughs> um, so. With this double backflip, with the, the the skills that you're you're honing in, um, do you do you like more of the competition feel? Do you like the freestyle with the filming? Like, what type of snowboarding do you? I mean, the the main thing to do is just have fun with your friends. Okay. Just 
just go out there, have good times. Don't worry about filming or anything, but because filming can kind of kind of get to your head, like it's I don't know, it's a lot to worry about, yeah. like in competitions, you kind of get nervous, and you just gotta have fun with it. And with that, with the nerves, with the nerves coming up, like is there any type of song that mellows you out? Is there something that just gives you rage to do your best? Um, no, not really. I just not really any particular okay. song. Okay. Rap. Yep, rap. Okay. <laughs> there you go. It's all about that. Um, and so with with all that you've accomplished, um, what's what 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 are your goals? What other goals do you have for yourself? Well, the main goal would obviously to be to go pro, but for right now, the competition series that I'm in, it's called USASA, okay. and they have competitions at all like the local hills. So the Nationals takes place in Colorado, and the goal for me right now is to place in that. Place in that. And to place, I'm an outsider, don't know. <laughs> is, it, is it first, second, third? Is it? Uh, yeah, it's top three. Top three, and then, you, okay. Yeah, cool. it's usually out of like 60 plus people, though. And, and that fills up. Yeah, Everyone, a lot of people. A lot, holy cow. And so I also heard from a birdie that uh, we, won't, we won't touch on it, but you, you also do other sports like skateboarding. I do. I like to skateboard in the summer. Okay. And so it snow to the street, really. Yeah. Because <laughs> minus the straps. Yep. That's cool. So have you, I actually, I, you say you watched some clips on vid, uh, YouTube. I actually saw um, this snowboarder pretty much skateboard without straps. He would he would still have the straps on. <laughs> have you ever done anything out of your comfort zone? I mean, you, not you, not really. I just skateboard and snowboard. Okay, you just you're just to the meat of it, really. Yep. Okay, that's awesome, man. That's awesome. And so, with do you have all your friends into this sport? Um, most of them, yeah. Okay. Like. Got a lot of friends from all over. Like everywhere I go, I usually meet someone new. So every time I like go back to that place, I'm always riding with Dude, friends. That's awesome. Yeah, that's really cool. Well, that was it. That was everything with Blake Lamb. Such a cool guy. Um, w watch out for him on YouTube. He's a good man. Uh, Blake Lamb, thank you so much, man. <laughs> thank I appreciate you. everything, dude. Bite of the brownie.
And in first place, number 1387, Blake Lamb. Oh! Make sure you guys stick around for some photos. Stay here, we're gonna take some photos. Thank you guys very much for coming out today. You guys are awesome. Round of applause for you guys. Stuff. So show them some love. Oh, A 180 oh. to 50-50.